this is a linear audio amplifier on the breadboard. I want to show the schematic later. At first I want to show the linearity. Of course the amplifier is only linear as long as it, as it has an ohms resistance at its output here. This is a 150 ohms resistor and the amplifier amplifies approximately 10 times. So it has 3 volts, volts in 150 ohms and 5 volts at an open output. This is 20 hertz and this is 200 hertz. This is 2000 hertz. One set the time base to another frequency 2000 hertz and this is 200,000 hertz no 20,000 hertz this is 200,000 hertz this is a prox 300,000 hertz and now finally This is for 465,000 hertz. So you can see that the signal is amplified equally strong on all the, these frequencies. This is the circuit. Consists of two uh, BD139 transistors. In fact, it's a Darlington. And the working point from the Darlington is set with P1 is here. This is the input capacitor. This is a part of the filter. This is the emitter resistor. It sets the amplification and also the pureness of the waveform. When the amplification is too high, the waveform will of course be distorted. So both uh, potentiometers, this one and this one, have to be aligned with the help of an oscilloscope or a, a tone generator. So the circuit is suitable for a headphone. Personally I don't like the linear audio amplifiers because it's not adapted to the sensitivity of the human ear. But there are a lot of people that um, find linearity in an audio amplifier, linear, am linear amplification, um, very pretty. I don't demonstrate the circuit with CD, only with a tone generator, sound generator. This is the output capacitor for the audio and uh, when you want to use the circuit as a measuring amplifier you can take a 100 nanofarad capacitor, it's here, at its output. This is the emitter, uh, variable emitter resistor, it's 30 ohms and it's wire wound, it get gets a little bit warm but you can also use a carbon um, carbon type because it doesn't get extremely warm. This is the potentiometer to set the working point from the Darlington and this is the filter. This also makes a part makes a part with the uh, P1 this resist this resistor here. This is 4, 6, 5 uh, kilohertz.